I'm Janelyn Marcello with Breezeway Productions. We're here on the red carpet at the 27th Annual Movie Guide Awards. Stay tuned as we interview tonight's nominees. What brings you out tonight? Well, what brings me out tonight? Um, uh, well, Sony <laughs> brought me out tonight. And uh, I'm, I'm nominated for a film called Paul, Apostle of Christ. And I'm sh are you a good Catholic? You are, right. Okay, well, 37% uh, uh, of the audience were Catholic t for this film, and, and, and it's, uh, it's done very well in, in countries that still uh, adhere to Christianity. And it was a, it was a great privilege to, for me to be in the movie and to play such an extraordinary man as Paul, who perhaps with Peter is, is the man responsible for, for, the, for founding the Christian church, you know. And that was, and, to, and th those words, that we're so familiar with in the New Testament. Paul speaks for the first time. That was an extraordinary privilege. And they were written down by Luke, you know, the moment he spoke them. And uh, that was extraordinary. And, and, and actually, surprisingly, not difficult to make fresh. Did you have any, did you have any revelations while you were making the movie and doing this, the character development? I wouldn't call it, an, I wouldn't call, necessarily call it a revelations, but I was certainly filled with the spirit of Paul and with, in a sense, I rediscovered my own faith, which, had, which I had questioned for some time. I mean, I was brought up, you know, um, in uh, the English school system where you go to chapel every day, and I was a, I was a, a I trained as a chorister from the age of seven at the Royal College of Church Music. So, ceremony I'm entirely familiar with. I'm perhaps less familiar with the finer feelings. And I rediscovered some of those through playing Paul. So it's it renewed your faith and how... In a sense it has. Because, I mean, you know, it's an organic process for me acting and I wasn't sure how to approach it. I didn't really have to give it much thought because Paul spoke through me.